I'm Taylor from What Taylor Likes. I decided I'm going to show you a little bit of uh, behind the scenes of how I styled my hair for this particular photo shoot. So if you want to get a picture like this, or like this, or like this one, look, it's kind of flower child-esque, Frida Kahlo inspired. So if you want your hair like this, let's get started. I completed my makeup, did my hair. Um, I just got a whole bunch of hair, put it on top. You want to go to the store. You want to buy a dozen roses or whatever your flower of choice is. You want to cut the rose down to about an inch, inch and a half. This rose that I'm trying to put in my hair right now, I realized I cut this stem a little bit too short. It was about less, like half an inch. So then I realized, oh, that was wrong. So I cut a new flower about an inch and a half away from the actual bud at a slant. A slant is key because it kind of helps stick in there. You want to get the bobby pin. Bobby pin the stem first, like hook the bobby pin around the stem and then secure it down to your head. Now I'm getting some leaves. Um, again, putting the bobby pin around the stem of the leaves, putting it in your hair. Here I have another rose. I'm hooking it on and then I hook it to my puff. Now I'm not just sticking it in my puff. I'm grabbing some pieces from my hair and then securing it down to my actual head. With these two flowers, I was like messing with it because they were not secure enough. So if that happens, just grab another bobby pin and secure it down. Again, get the rose, cut it at a slant, hook the bobby pin on and then get some hair from your puff and then secure it down to your actual scalp. That way it does not move around. Here I decided that the rose in the back of my head needed two bobby pins. So I did that. Grabbing more leaves, hooking the bobby pin around, sticking it in your hair. The leaves are key because it kind of makes your hair look like a bouquet of flowers. And that is what you want. You want to be a flower child. All right, so that one's moving around too much. I grab another bobby pin and I secured it down. Grabbing more leaves here just to kind of make it look more earthy, more nature-like. Um, playing with it, moving it around. You don't want all the roses to look the same. So you kind of want to position them all around your little curly hair. All right, so I'm sticking the fourth one in, um, bobby pinning that down, putting another bobby pin. Whoop, got a little, got a little pillow out of there. Sticking another bobby pin, and then yeah, that's what it looks like. I'm grabbing more leaves because I decided that you know, might as well. Once you got all your flowers in, just fluff out your hair, fluff, 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 and then yeah, we're done. Cute.